and welcome to Uncommon Knowledge. I'm Dr. Tyra Drawade. Thank you for spending your time with me today. Today our topic is urinary tract infections, also called bladder infections, also called UTIs. And we're focusing particularly on UTIs that happen after sexual activity. So what are symptoms of UTIs? Uh, pain with urination, burning with urination, urinating frequently, you know, going to the bathroom frequently to pee, blood in the urine. Those are signs of a UTI. UTIs are easily treated. UTIs are not sexually transmitted infections, so I don't want you to panic about that. So if you notice that you're getting frequent UTIs, especially after sexual activity, um, a couple of things could be could be causing that. The first one could be that your partner is uncircumcised. If you have a male partner, your partner is uncircumcised. Um, bacteria hides in the foreskin. That bacteria is introduced into the vagina during sexual activity. That bacteria can then latch onto your urethra, where you pee from, and get into your bladder and cause a bladder infection. The first solution is to pee right after sex. So go to the bathroom, empty your bladder after sex. Um, that reduces the chances for that bacteria to stick around. The second solution is to take an antibiotic. You know, we give you a prescription, you take a pill right after sex to reduce the chances of getting an infection. The third solution is to have your partner wear a condom. That will reduce the amount of bacteria that gets introduced to you during sexual activity. Now, the second reason it could be happening is menopause. Menopause means men sees pause, or they stop actually. Uh, remember from our menstrual cycle video, uh, if you haven't watched that video, I'll post the link down here for you to check out. During the menstrual cycle, your ovaries make estrogen, and that allows you to have a period. When you are in menopause, your ovaries are shutting down, so they're not making estrogen, and you're not having a period. Now, the vagina needs estrogen. That's what keeps us strong and reduces your chances of recurrent infections. And so during menopause, the, there's no estrogen, the vagina is dry, makes it more susceptible to infections, especially after sexual activity. So the treatment for that is um, void after sex, empty your bladder after sexual activity. The second one is we replace that estrogen. So we give women back estrogen, either in pill form, cream form, ring form, any form that is um, that they can tolerate is what we give to them. And that usually solves the problem. I hope this has been helpful. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow us on Instagram and Facebook. And if you are in the Homewood Flossmore area, drop by, stop by the office and let us take care of you. I look forward to seeing you in the next Uncommon Knowledge episode.